doing a podcast on cupcakes and to mark the occasion I've even worn my Lottery cupcake t-shirt so I'm here in Glorietta now and things are just opening but I'm here to celebrate the opening of cupcakes by Sonja this is their second store and as you know her first store opened seven years ago in Surendra and so I'm really really happy to be here to be with Sonja later on So here we are, the, the counter, it just like beckons people from Glorietta. Yes, well, we, we always want to keep the cupcakes as the star. Okay. And you see that even in the logo, that's, that's the focus. And, and with this one, we wanted people to pass by and sort of see all the colors and, and the varieties that we have. And yes, you do have more varieties, it seems, here yes. than you do at your Surrender store. Um, the, the plan is really to just keep on constantly, to just add new flavors. And Fantastic! Sort of, you know, relevant and, 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 and also new trends to, to introduce it and, and we've also expanded. Yes, you've expanded to the different, um, so you have cookies here and brownies, yes? And yes. blondies as well. So we've been also making wedding cakes. And, oh, wow! Yes, and dessert buffets and, and okay. things like that. But, but cupcakes will always be our focus. One of the greatest accents that I really like about your store, Sanja, are these whisks. I mean, what a genius way to make use of whisks. I, I worked with my old interior designer and, and of course she did the Surrender store and we both felt like we wanted to do new stuff with the new, I mean, as we expand, we wanted to sort of update the brand also and update the look. So we were thinking of creative ways, how to, you know, to like a play with, with things that you see in a kitchen so this is one of the most used baking tool in a bakery so we said okay let's do chandeliers and and yeah so and, smart. And, and then you've got your colander yes, lamps and colander there. lamps and, and hopefully you know I mean as we grow we can add more um, more items like that So now that I've um, toured through your store, you have a special treat for me today. Yes. We get to frost cupcakes yes. today. Yes. 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 Sanja, thank you so much. I've always wanted to learn how to frost cupcakes the Sanja style. So I'm just okay. sort of like um, smoothing, smoothening it out. Okay. And then um, oh, I just, so sort, of, I just sort of get a dollop. And then you just try to shape it. Okay, let's okay. see. Let's see. Okay, so there. Okay. Let's, so that and everybody can see. So this is there. the kind of shape that we're going for. Yeah, okay, something, that kind of a shape. Something, something similar. Yeah. So, something, a nice looking lump. <laughs> yeah, you just um, put it on the cupcake. And you're just also slowly shaping it already. Okay. And so, I noticed that you're, you're sort of like yes, shaking your hand a little I'm going bit. in a... You know, in circular. In a circular motion, okay. and then you clean. Oh, that's already. So that's so pretty already. The way it is, that we can sell it right now. Yeah. There. <laughs> okay, but yes. I know and this then, is not done yet. Yes. It's got your characteristic Sanja yes. swirl. And then you, just, if if there are a bit of imperfections, then you could just sort of just go around it. But then, okay. You know, and then you go to the middle, and then you just sort of press, and then go up, something like that. I can eat this now without sprinkles, and I'll be very happy with it. <laughs> so you just put you it just, in that little yes. crevice that so the there. spatula is made. So yeah, That's so nice. Yeah. Well, cupcakes are always so pretty, anyways. 
Roger, what is this new one? I don't think I've ever seen this before. This is the, this is the upside down pineapple cupcake. And then we... Wow, that is a very <laughs> retro dessert. <laughs> yeah. That is my dad's favorite yeah. dessert, but in cupcake form. Yeah. And then we put a, like a... Is that whipped cream? Yeah. Oh and God. then we just finish it off with a cherry. Okay. You know what though, Sanja? I mean, the fact that we were frosting cupcakes and preparing them, I, it just came to my mind, how many cupcakes have you sold in the seven years that Cupcakes by Sanja has been open? Well, um, well we've been sort of lucky because we sell about a thousand cupcakes a day, so I guess that's about three million cupcakes. Wow, that's yeah. astounding. So if we put one cupcake up on top of each other, it might reach the moon. Was, maybe, maybe. Yeah. Well, that, that's a lot of cupcakes. Yeah. yeah. I can only imagine, only imagine what it'd be like, what it'd be like, what it'd be like, like, like what it'd be like. Oh, that smells nice. Me too. Is that good? Yeah, it's yeah. not yours. My goodness. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Sanja, frosting those cupcakes, I knew it would be difficult. But you did a great really job. <laughs> takes, takes practice. Yeah. So what do we have here today? Um, well, we have we have coffee. Okay, which, but wait. Okay. I hear that your coffee is a very special yeah. it's a very special blend. Tell us yes, about it. Um well I think you know um the people behind Kraft. Yes. So Kraft Coffee and um This is the one in New Manila. It's a yes. third wave artisan coffee yes. shop. Um a friend of mine um introduced them to me and then I I, I, I went there and I thought their coffee was amazing. It I'm is, really, really it is. great that they have it here. I met with them, really great guys and, and they they basically came up with a with a blend especially okay. for us and they, they we tried it with cupcakes and stuff like that and I've got a drink over here to yes. my right this is well, that's it a, smells so yeah. good. It's a flavored iced yeah. tea. Yeah, that's uh, well, we brew our own iced tea, so um, that's a strawberry basil. It's it's wow. one of. I mean, we're we're actually going to expand um, our beverage line and just sort of do a lot of pairings with cupcakes. Wait, that's, cupcake and beverage pairings? Yes. yes. How exciting! Tell yes, me more. Yes, yes, it's really exciting because um, you know it's also like you know you we want to give people that whole experience when they come to the store. So it's not just about the cupcakes also about what you drink with it um this one is, is sort of like a we call, we call it cookie overload oh. since we try to throw in whatever ingredient we have it looks like a planet <laughs> exactly so i think with this one um we put mallows and and um and pretzels and nuts like that and um and this one is what we did earlier yeah, i this think is the, yeah um, I, the pineapple upside yes, down. Yes. This is, this is wonderful. Yes. And um, again, we're also doing a lot of nostalgic desserts. So brownies is so nostalgic. And and this one is um, it's a chocolate overload. It's a, basically it's a chocolate cake um, with a secret filling and then there's chocolate frosting. It, it's, it's a different base from this one. Um, I try not to make the same bases for all. But well, you know what, Sanja? I've had a yes. really great time with you this morning. Me too. I mean, Me what too. better way to start yes. the morning yeah. than with coffee and cupcakes? And seeing you, it's yeah. been so it's long. So long. <laughs> you know, I've always wanted to ask you this question, but yeah. in the seven years that you've been in business, what are your thoughts about you having started the cupcake trend and more specifically introducing Filipinos to red velvet, which is, I yes. think, your best-selling flavor? Yeah. Um, I guess I'm, I'm so lucky that I was the first one to kind of open a store. I'm sure there were cupcakes um, being made at home, but then in terms of um, in terms of the the store that only specializes in cupcakes, I, I'm, I'm very lucky that I was the first one. It's really nice when people say that, and people ask me all the time, like, how do I feel? Because there are other cupcake stores opening, and honestly, it, it's a good thing because it means that the, the business is here, that it's a it's a dynamic business, and it's still growing, and there's still room for for more. It can only be more exciting for us consumers yeah. as time goes on. So let's invite them yes. to your cupcakes by Sanja store here in Glorietta let them know yes, where it is um, please um, come over um, and visit the store in Glorietta it's on the second floor um, of by the bridgeway of Glorietta 2 all right Thank you. and for now go and have yourself a cupcake everybody bye, bye.